is going on ladies and gentlemen my name is Swigger and I've got another League of Legends game for you playing Kha'Zix in the jungle um, sorry if my voice is a little bit off um, I think in the past couple videos I've already said and I'm recording this all in the same day I am sick not feeling very good but uh, gonna try to get some content out here because I'm too sick to go to work but I'm not too sick to at least play League of Legends and try to get some uh, good recordings up so I'm playing Kha'Zix in the jungle who is currently kind of the flavor of the month jungler right now. Um, he's got a lot of damage, he's uh, very mobile, um, he, he's just an all-round fairly good assassin jungle pick uh, with really good clear time and uh, yeah, single target damage, he's he's really really good. Um, and I didn't even know that I had Mecha Kha'Zix skin, so that's, that's pretty cool. Um, I always love it when you click on a champion that you haven't played in a while and you have a skin for him all of a sudden. So somebody must have gifted that to me, and uh, I gotta say I really, really appreciate it to whoever did give that to me. I'm not entirely sure who did it, but uh, still, pretty pretty damn awesome. Uh, I don't know what the hell this Zed is doing. <laughs> like, He just kind of walked by like it was nothing. Okay, Zed's dead. Oh man, <laughs> I don't know what exactly people were uh, were thinking there. <laughs> that was just like, he, uh, yeah, yeah, he's just gonna kind of chill there, and uh, he did bait the the pull, which was great. But after he baited the pull, he should just kind of run down towards the tri brush and uh, joined us. But uh, what can you do? So Zed got first blooded by the enemy team. First blood went to Oriana. That is definitely not good. But the Oriana's got revive, uh, which is interesting. I'm not entirely sure what to think of that. Is this like new meta breaking shit here? Maybe it's something that I don't know about. Bandouche! There we go, heal up off of my void spikes, and there we go. Our jungle is underway. And, uh, yeah, the, the beginning of jungle is always kind of boring. You just kind of sit here and, uh, poke shots at people and do stuff and, yeah, boosh, there you go, and blah, 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 blah. Gonna try to, uh, keep as healthy as I can. So that way I can, uh, make a pretty good first gank. Um, I'm, I'm still kind of debating. I haven't played Kha'Zix in quite some time, and I'm just kind of sitting here wondering what I should be evolving first. Um, a lot of people told me that I should be evolving my uh, my Q first for the better clear. Um, but a lot of people also tell me that uh, you should probably have your evolved wings for better gank potential and escapability. Um, so, you know, not entirely sure. I'm going to have to kind of see how, uh, how things play out and what I want to kind of do with things. But I, I feel like I'm going to do my wings. Ugh, I, I, damn it, you know, I just, I just don't know. I just don't know. Like, having your claws upgraded is so damn awesome, because you do so much freaking damage with it. But I can understand the, uh, the draw of, uh, having those upgraded wings, so you can jump in and out of fights, you can escape, you can kill. It's very, very promising. So, maybe I'll evolve the wings first. Let's give that a try, actually, yeah. I think I'm gonna be okay with that. I don't want to evolve my Void Spikes first. I just don't really see much of a need for the uh, the three prong void spikes until later on in the game. Um, I have no idea where J4 is. It looks. Oh Jesus! No, we're not not doing that. Okay. Um. Okay, so it looks like Jarvan is coming down here. Man, that was, uh, that was some scary stuff. So Jarvan's Ignite is down, at least. So at least Nunu has that information. I had to flash away, though, because Jarvan did a shit ton of damage with his passive. But hopefully Nunu can kind of abuse that. Oh, Jesus. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo! Oh, that is the importance of timing your jump. Um, if I had jumped too early, he would have followed me through with his kick. Well, his Sonic Wave. Um, so luckily I, I managed to jump at the appropriate time that I got away from that one, but uh, still some scary stuff I gotta say Okay, so we're doing pretty well. I'm gonna try to take my white. I think I have enough to uh, I think I have enough to take this 
Maybe I don't actually. I'm gonna run. Yeah. Getting a little bit greedy there, thinking that I could do that. I was pretty low health, so I'll, I'll just be. Luckily, I haven't really wasted a whole lot of time, but if I could have taken that down, if I had my smite, I might have been able to take that down, but uh, sadly, I did not have that right away. I'm going to pick this up, grab myself my boots and a couple more pots. There we go. And jump! There we go. So I'm assuming that my wraiths are pretty well gone. That information is coming solely from the fact that I just saw Lee Sin in our jungle. Uh, and he probably counter jungled a little bit. Yep, I was uh, I was right in that notion. There we go. So, um, I don't really think that I need to uh, go into the mid lane. It looks like Orianna isn't really trying to... F well, you know what, maybe I will. Damn, I really thought that I was going to get that. Boosh. There we go. Oh, you're Zed. I kept it warm for you. Oh, that's not good. But at least a return kill from the Blitzcrank. But Varus is starting to get a little bit strong for my liking. So maybe I'm going to have to start paying a little bit more attention to the bot lane here. But I would really like to get 6 before I start going to the bot lane. Because then you can make some pretty serious lane ganks happen. And I think that's what's going to really catch bot lane off guard. So we're just back to the good old farming game. I think I cancelled an auto attack there. That was pretty dumb of me. There we go. Let's go up and do my wraiths, and then my blue buff is going to be available. So I'm going to go and do the blue buff. Luckily, uh, we're not at kind of the ELO where a Zed is going to really want to take the blue buff, so I don't think I'm going to piss him off in any way. But uh, me getting the blue buff uh, is going to make a pretty big difference. I can just kind of spam my abilities in the jungle and hopefully not die right when I get it. Uh, that seems to be a tendency when I play my jungle games is I just... Uh, I get a buff and then I'm like, oh man, yeah, I'm invincible now. And then I uh, I run in and do very stupid things and get myself killed. So let's try to avoid doing that after I take this blue buff. Okay, I got that one. And now I've got my, uh, my ult. So let's go ahead and get those wings that I was talking about. Okay, um... Oh, man. Come on, buddy. Oh, jeez. Had to escape that one. Looks like Blitzcrank is still going, though. Two. One. Oh, got him. Woohoo! Run away. Oh, what? Damn it, the flay! <laughs> exactly what I was worried about. Come on, Draven. There we go. Okay, he got his uh, his stacks cashed in. Um, so that was definitely worth it. Uh, I hate the fact that I lost a blue buff, but it did get transferred over to the Draven, so I'm not overly concerned about that. Um, I think that still generally works out in our favor. But uh, still, I would have liked to have survived that one. But uh, what can you do? You know what? I'm actually going to buy another sword as weird as that might sound but i definitely do think that that was worth it because uh i ended up getting a kill onto the varus which was good um and then draven got a kill onto the thresh and he also got to cash in his stacks his adoration stacks. so we got a little bit more gold for that and we got a bunch of assists on it as well so uh definitely think that that was worth our while for me to uh die on that one but luckily that blitzcrank just was uh really really going for that kill and it really made all the difference for us that he uh, he really went for it. Let's say the Oriana taking a little bit of heat. The Blitzcrank trying to get in there. Great grab, and that's going to be a death. And what? Man, it looks like he already took the damage from the turret by the time he got in there. So the uh, Zed ends up living, which is amazing. And that's going to be one dead Oriana. 
it looks like it was the Blitzcrank, I think, who picked up that kill, too. Um, would have rather it been Zed, but I'm not going to complain. Kill's a kill. Oh, that was a, uh, a dead Nunu. Okay, I'm just going to jump up here and try to take as much of this CS as I can. Hopefully they don't try to uh, dive me horribly. There we go. So Lee Sin is here, but uh, I've still got my uh, my ultimate, so I can get away pretty easily if they uh, if they choose to really dive me. I'm not too concerned about this, and I'm wasting a lot of Lee Sin's time. He's not getting anything from staying here. There we go. So I'm just gonna kind of chill here and uh, kind of wait it out. So there we go. I got a good amount of CS from that. Got a good amount of experience as well. I'm currently a level above the Lee Sin. So, uh, yeah. All in all, things going decently well for me. Uh, considering that I haven't played Kazakhs in God knows how long. But uh, 50 CS, I, I feel like I'm kind of living up to the, the standard in the jungle. Uh, Lee Sin's at 47, and I've got quite an item advantage on him. I'm going to be building a Brutalizer, which is uh, mainly the reason why I built that... Uh, Oh, I'm coming. I believe they're doing the dragon right now, so I'm going to try to get there as quickly as humanly possible. Woohoo! Oh, no! Oh, God! Oh, my God! I lived! I lived! I lived! I lived! I'm alive! I'm alive. And I got the dragon! <laughs> How have we not talked about this yet? I stole the dragon. Got it! Oh, God. Okay. I am alive. Woo! And I stole the dragon. So I am feeling pretty damn content with myself right now because that was not something that I was expecting me to do. But I got in there, used my jump, used my claws, and stole that dragon. So feeling pretty damn good. Okay, so I am going to probably just continue to farm. And uh, I'm not entirely sure what I should be building here. Um, I've got my Brutalizer, so I'm going to be doing a, a good chunk of damage to people. Um, and then maybe I'm going to build... I'm going to finish my Spirit of the Lizard Elder. That's definitely an important, uh, important aspect of my build that I want to get done pretty early. Oh god, we're calling people out already. Don't play much Draven, do you? Maybe he doesn't. Draven's a... He's definitely an interesting ADC. He's not like most. So if you don't play him very frequently, I can understand that uh, it's going to show. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> what a fucker. Why would he do that? I didn't do anything to him. I was trying to help this entire time. So I'm just going to place a ward down here, try to make it a little bit easier for everybody. No! Oh, thank god. Okay, I'm going to try to push this lane because it looks like everybody was, uh... Oh, ju I'm just going to miss that entirely. But no matter. There we go. Okay, Orion is back here. And I'm going to run and try to take my wraiths. Oh, shut down for- what the hell? Thresh was on a killing spree. Not gonna complain. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, a double kill for the Draven. So he gets called out by the Blitzcrank and he shows up. Way to go, Draven. Nicely freaking done. I wonder how much of that was the Blitzcrank, though. Um, if Draven doesn't really play Draven too often. But still, I will not complain. That is awesome to see that we are uh, starting to make some, starting to make some waves in that bot lane. Um, trying to think how much. Okay, I can technically. You know what? I'm just gonna go back and grab that right now. There's no point in me sticking in the jungle right now when I can go back and grab a pretty substantial item. So let's pick this one up, and I'm also gonna pick up a pink ward. Wow! So I can help out everybody just a little bit. I'm probably going to place a pink ward right where I put my trinket ward. Right down here. 
Um, so that way, uh, it's going to be a little bit of vision for the uh, the Zed to see things like this Lee Sin coming up. That'd be very good for him to know. Um, and I think at this point, I'm probably going to start counter jungling a little bit. I feel like I'm at that point where I'm I'm doing enough damage that my dual potential is really good. So maybe I'm going to go for that. Dush. Dush. There we go. Okay, so got a lot of CS. Um, after this, I'm probably going to start ganking a lot uh, once I got my red. Not entirely sure why I smited that early. Um, could very well get smite stolen, but... Luckily, it was not. Looks like Lee Sin is dead from the Zed. Is Zed gonna? No, he is not gonna make it out. But I'm gonna come and try to uh, take down this Jarvan. Not entirely sure if I'm gonna be able to, but if Nunu pushes it up and he's still there, then uh, then we can definitely make something happen. Um, if he's not there, um, I'm just gonna help this Nunu. Oh, jeez. Thank you. Loving it. Okay, now I'm going to get my second evolution of my claws. Booyah. There we go. So I feel like I have helped my team a fair amount. Killing that Jarvan, definitely a good thing. I don't believe Nunu got an assist for that one, but uh, I can't believe he went for that white. That was uh, definitely a risky decision considering of how low he was. But I'm going to get my cooldown reduction boots because I think it's pretty good on Kha'Zix to, uh, to have those and grab my uh, my Brawler's gloves because I want to be going into that uh, Ghost Blade pretty early. Um, being able to stealth up and then pop my Ghost Blade and destroy people, very, very good on Kha'Zix. Um, and then following that, I'm going to have to kind of decide which item image I want to go um, because there are definitely a lot of paths that I could take as Kha'Zix and I'm, I'm thinking right now it's going to be mostly a damage build. Um, simply because I don't think they have a lot of ways of stopping me. Okay. Looks like I can't really get in here. Oh, God. Okay, I managed to get out of there. And wow, Leeson just did work. Sorry, uh, uh, what am I trying to say here? Zed! Zed is the person who did work. But, uh, managed to get a kill and I managed to escape, so I'm pretty happy about how that went. Um, looks like the dragon is up right now. So we could probably try to take that. Um, I guess I'm gonna try to come back here and... No, I'm not! My god. That was some scary business. There you go, heal up a little bit. Looks like they knew what they were doing. Okay, so it looks like they're uh, currently having a good time up here. Okay, I think this guy's gonna die, yep. Oh, I'm so damn slow! Okay. Oh god. Well, I don't want anything to do with this anymore. Woo -hoo -hoo! No! Damn it! <laughs> Fucking Lee Sin. How much did that do? 145, that sucks. I managed to escape that for a little while, but uh, we did manage to at least get the kill on that one. So, can't complain about how that went. And while this is all going on, Nunu has just been up in this top lane, pushing the shit out of the lane. Uh, taking down that second tier turret, so definitely not going to complain about how that went. Um, I'm going to finish off my home guard first, I think. Um, and then also finish off my ghost blade. Wow, I've actually got way more money than I expected to have. Um, and then I'm gonna go for the uh, the hurricane. I think this is actually a really good item on Kha'Zix um, Simply because uh, it gives me so much wave clear. Um, it allows me to really destroy my jungle quickly um, 
and it gives me a lot more damage, a lot more assassination ability. Um, really just overall, I think, a great pickup. But it uh, looks like the... Uh, Oh god. Oh wow, she knocked me out! No! Two, one, no! No, 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 no! Rah! Slow him down! Oh Jesus! Oh please! Thank you, God! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Cannot believe I made it away from that one, but thank God I completed my ghost blade because that is what kept me alive in that fight. Holy Jeepers Creepers! Now that is going to be one dead Varus. It looks like our team is going to do pretty well in that fight. I'm just going to pick up another longsword. Help my uh, overall damage. And it looks like they are just going to go for that dragon because they got an ace so they don't have to worry about a jungler coming in and smiting it. I'm going to jump to try to get to this lane a little bit quicker. I'm actually going to go for my race first and then try to get my red buff. I think that'll be a pretty good uh, series of events. And... Rah! So overall, four, two, and five. Um, feeling pretty good about how this uh, this game is going so far. Can't really complain. Could be a lot worse, considering that I haven't played Kazakhs in quite some time. This is uh, this is pretty fantastic. So 600 gold. I don't really know what I want to build into next. Maybe go for some defensive items. Hmm. This Blitzcrank, though. Really good, I gotta say. He's been landing hook after hook after hook. And really supporting the team well. Aw, oh, damn, if only. Thank you! <laughs> oh, there we go. He's got the red buff now. And I got an assist, which is all I really care about. I had some impact in that. Oh, is that what we're going for? Let's do it, Blitz. Oh, I completely missed my jump. <laughs> well, that was uh, that was a thing that happened. So, a little bit embarrassing on my part. Probably should have landed that. Oh, but maybe I can make it into this one. Yeah, there we go. That's what I wanted. Just get a nice easy kill onto that Oriana while wow, she was trying to escape. There we go, and there's our ace. Oh, there's the Zed. Oh man, he's not gonna die either. Perfectly done, and Draven has been pushing the bot lane for this entire time. And there's gonna be the turret. I don't know if we're gonna be able to... Uh, no, it looks like their blue buff is not available. But I'm gonna go over here and just try to take their white. Try to take as much as I can from them. Because it makes me feel better as a person and as a jungler. Oh, people congratulating me on my plat. I did finally manage to get platinum ranking. Thank God, because it's only been like six series that I failed. Uh, but finally did manage to take that one. But um, not talking about that right now. We are talking about the jungle Kazakhs game. Uh, we do right now have a pink ward in this barren area. I'm going to put a pink ward probably like in the dragon area just so we have an easy clear. Um, I do still have my Trinket Ward, and a lot of people are probably going to be yelling at me of like, why haven't you replaced your Trinket Ward? Why aren't you getting the Sweeper? I will admit the Sweeper is better, but uh, for right now, being the jungler, I want that uh, that ward just in case uh, they try to do a Baron. I want to be able to put a ward down so I can see what's going on, so I can... Oh, God. Okay, I'm still alive. Okay, don't want to get caught by a shockwave, though. Oh, God. Whew, that was close. Gonna maybe try to heal up off of this. Oh, you son of a bitch. What is with everybody and taking my damn minions? Girl, you do not know how much I need those wraiths. Ow. Huh. Okay, managed to avoid that. Oh, there we go. What's up, baby? 
Come on, where are you going? Where are you going? Thought we were having a good time. There we go. That's what we were looking for. Wee! There we go. It is the game. Gonna pop my stealth and run into the turret because why the hell not? Very, very nicely played. Really, really fun game as that Kazix Jungle, who is currently kind of the flavor of the month jungler. So hopefully you guys enjoyed me playing him. If you did, press that like button, show it some love, leave a comment in the comment section. I'll try to answer you and subscribe if you haven't already. Come on, guys, get on the bandwagon. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video.